I was, I was hitting him with body punching. I heard him actually he was crying in there, making woman gestures like, oh, oh, oh. I can't How, find you, him, but I knew that he was breaking down soon. You're saying that Biggs was crying when yes, you hit him? Yes. for you undefeated after 27 pro fights Mike Tyson would get his title shot a day with destiny at the age of 20 this is what Mike Tyson has trained his whole life for this is what Customato and Jimmy Jacobs so this is the biggest night in the history of boxing for Trevor Burbank that man was Angelo Dundee and the likes of Muhammad Ali and Sugar Ray Leonard and you could go back to uh, guys like Luis Manuel Rodriguez, the former middleweight champ and oh, just tremendous. And look at young Mike Tyson, age 20 years old. He could go into the record books tonight as one of the very youngest heavyweight champions of all time if he can capture the title from the reigning champ Trevor Burbank. 12 rounds of boxing for the WBC Championship of the World. Introducing, in the blue corner, fighting out of Catskill, New York, weighing 221 and one quarter pounds. He is undefeated in his professional career with 27 wins, no defeats, 25 KOs. He is the challenger, Mike Tyson. in the red corner, formerly of Jamaica, now fighting out of Miami, Florida, weighing 218 and one half pounds. His professional record consists of 31 wins, four defeats, one draw, and 23 KOs. He is the WBC heavyweight champion of the world, Trevor Burbank. Now listen, when, if you get in close and I tell you to break your stop punch and step back clean, and you question the challenge or chief second, and you question the champion or chief second, all right, let's get it on, come on. Let's see how long that brain lasts. Otto here, standing toe-to-toe -to -toe without the way. Tyson will have no part of it. Tyson will be able to get underneath it.
done. It's all over. We've got a brand new heavyweight champion of the world, Mike Tyson. Of the second round, the winner by a TKO and youngest and new WBC heavyweight champion of the world, Michael Tyson. Like Holmes, I had problems with his reason for coming back. He said that he wanted to avenge those two losses against Michael Spinks and also kind of, it's like a, a vindication to get back at what he did against Michael Spinks. And the first question on everybody's lips here in Atlantic City, whether it's to the press or whether it's to former fighters or to just the folks around and about the casinos, is do you give Larry Holmes any chance whatsoever? The almost unanimous verdict is no. What about you? Do you give him a chance? Well, I give uh, Larry Holmes a chance, mainly because of his past experience. He's a very intelligent man in the ring, and he has the height and reach advantage. In other words, he has the physical attributes to compete with the Mike Tyson if he's okay upstairs. For him, the first round is, is vital. He has survived the first round, but also gained respect in the first round. Tyson is made to order for Larry Holmes because he's right in front of you, and he has to get set to be able to punch. But Kevin Rooney says that Mike Tyson... There is a look at an angry young man. Don't get exercised here, Ray. Let's not get overexcited. <laughs> and there is the record of Larry Holmes. Won 48 in a row, of course, before he lost those two fights to Michael Spinks. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to rumble! 12 rounds for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He's wearing the white trunks with red trim and weighs 225 and three quarter pounds. From Easton, Pennsylvania, his professional record, 48 victories, only two defeats. 34 KOs. For seven and a half years, he ruled the division as an undefeated champion with 20 successful defenses. Tonight, he's the challenger. Ladies and gentlemen, the man known as the Eastern Assassin, former heavyweight champion of the world, Larry Ho! And in the red corner, wearing the solid black trunks, weighing 215 and three quarter pounds, from Catskill, New York, which is the home, hometown of the late great trainer of champions, Casamato. His professional record, a perfect 32 and 0, 28 KOs, 23 KOs in four rounds or less, and 16 knockouts in the first round. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you the undefeated, undisputed, heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson! All right, gentlemen, I gave you both the rules in the dressing room. And remember what I told you, I'm here to enforce my rules, obey my commands at all times. Any questions? All right, shake hands, good luck to both of you. Murderous monster, can't keep my nose straight, sipping on this Hennessy, waiting for the time to break. Show up and motherfuckers bow down, recognize West Side Death Row, outlaw riders. Niggas 
is under me. They bitches come with me. There's a left hook by Tyson. Poor folks, my motto is fully guaranteed. Niggas is playing haters. Letting them my enemies, I'm dumb. That was a big right hand. Best punch of the fight. Medical Association could love. Also, my wife who hates violence. That's you really are. Hey, Big Jack. So, uh, another one. Me, me. Let, let him do it. Okay. okay. All right. Let who do it? Okay. Do it. All right. Okay. Hold on. Let's go now. Come on now. Oh, shit. Don't tell me. I ain't holding you tight. You're not punching me. Let him hold you. Give me that crap. Spit down the book. You don't have another bucket. Let's spit down that one. Take that. Give me your mouthpiece. Pop, 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 pop. Remember, pop, pop. Pop, okay. pop. Okay. To the body. Then bring it upstairs. But use the jab. Behind the jab. You understand? Pressure. Right. 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 What you doing? underneath him too and I wouldn't be surprised if he might not have had a little problem there as well but I think Larry Merchant really hit it Mike Tyson is a great finisher 55 seconds of the fourth round the winner and still the undisputed undefeated heavyweight champion of the world Iron Mike No socks. And you see that he has no robe. You know, when I look at Mike Tyson, I get the feeling he's so dense that it's like picking up a baseball and finding it weighs 30 pounds. And there's his record, as you can see, unbeaten. Mike Tyson has always comes in very warmed up. You can see a nine-year age difference. Other than that, I think probably the only really startling number there is that Thomas came in at 217, and he does have a reach advantage of some three and a half inches. I don't really know that that will be any factor in this fight at all. Calls himself a gladiator. Here's a part of that whole look. Throwback. <laughs> and a coin tucked into his 
laces on his right shoe. I'll have to ask him about that. It must be really a sentimental know. piece. This is the main event of the evening. 12 rounds of boxing for the WBA, WBC, heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing, in the blue corner, fighting out of West Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 217 and three quarter pounds, with a professional record of 29 wins, one defeat, one draw, and 24 KOs. He's rated number one in the world by the WBC and is a former champion of that organization. Ladies and gentlemen, here is Pinklin, Pinky Thomas. And in the red corner, fighting out of the Catskills in New York, weighing 218 and three quarter pounds. He is undefeated in his professional career with 29 wins, no defeats, 26 KOs. He is the WBC, WBA, heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. Don't put too much grease. Don't throw any punches during the break. Is that understood? Sergey's come out fighting. Everything first, everything. You know, Give him right. movement. Let's go. Come on. Put on that jab and be a little more aggressive. Come on now. Don't be fucking out this guy. You understand? Come on. I'm expecting to see a lot of guys try up my side. Understand the key to, to winning is winning is do it your way. There was a big uppercut by Tyson. And a right hand behind him. Thomas in trouble again. And now Tyson moves in for the kill. You up the punch in the air. Thomas trying to hold on. Serious trouble. And down he goes. Oh! Great finisher. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's over. It is over. Thomas did not make it by the count of ten. You heard in the corner. It would be. Good fight, man. Good fight. Thank you. Good fight. Good fight also. It's my pleasure to give you a shot at the title. Because you deserve it. Answer this question. Two minutes of the sixth round. Referee Carlos Padilla stops the bout. The winner by a TKO and still WBC, WBA, heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson.
a fight in 12 years. Record of 34 and 0, and that doesn't count his recent bouts with his wife and his. And now, ladies and gentlemen, once and for all, let's get ready to rumble 12 rounds for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the white trunks with black trim, and weighing in at 212 and one quarter pounds. He's originally from St. Louis, Missouri, now lives in Wilmington, Delaware. This. Olympic gold medal champion, has a professional record of 31 victories without a loss, 21 by knockout. He is the former undisputed and undefeated light heavyweight champion of the world and the only king of that division ever to win the heavyweight title in the history of boxing. Because he never lost that title in the ring, he is still recognized by many, including Boxing Illustrated and Ring Magazine, as the heavyweight champion. Ladies and gentlemen, the undefeated man who brings the jinx, Michael Speed. And fighting out of the red corner, wearing the solid black trunks and weighing 218 and one quarter pounds, originally from the streets of Brooklyn. He passed through the hometown of the late great trainer of champions, Customato, Catskill, New York, and he now lives in North New Jersey. His professional record, 34 consecutive victories with 30 knockouts, including 26 KOs in five rounds or less, and 15 in the first round alone. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the undisputed, the undefeated, heavyweight champion of the world, And Larry, as referee Frank Cappuccino, are there any listen questions to this. by either of you? I right, both just touch gloves. Good luck to both of you. I do think that this fight will be decided by two things. But the show went on. At least it did for 91 seconds. Now watch Tyson jump right into his chest. <laughs> Tyson not afraid. As we expected, and Spinks ready to mix it up with him. Tyson along the ropes doing damage. He had me even landing it on the target, and he didn't hit me with one punch. Spinks has ever been down in a professional fight. ironic that in the afterglow of his greatest victory, Tyson focused less on the fight 
and more in the press. My trainer told me before I left, we, I, bet, I, took, I bet both of our persons that you knock him out in the first round. So I, had, and I thought he was serious, so just now he said he was lying. And so I went out and knocked him out in the first round. Mike didn't give him a chance to do anything else. But after the first knockdown, he got right on him and worked the body and then came out to the head again. That's what knocked him out. Left hook, so the left hook. Left it was a left, left uppercut up that you told me to throw. That's right. Then I threw a right hand to the body and he went down. And then from that punch, I think what was the right hand off the head? Uh, Mike Tyson, he's getting stronger. And the thing I was more impressed with is the fact that with all the distractions, with all the problems and the invasion of his personal life, he was able to block that thing out, those things out rather, and go on his mission to destroy Michael Spinks. Well, I've never believed that for a moment. Uh, since five minutes after Mike Tyson destroyed Trevor Burbick and won the title at the age of 20, people were saying, well, who can beat this kid? And I, among others, have been saying the only one who can beat him is himself. If he is caught up in the glory of being a champion, if he's distracted, if he yields to too many temptations, and so on. So tonight, he not only defeated Michael Spinks, he defeated the only guy who could really defeat him, himself. He weighed in at 220 pounds with an outstanding record of 43 wins, only one defeat, 37 wins coming by way of knockout. The youngest man ever to win the heavyweight crown, currently ranked the number one heavyweight contender by the WBC, by WBA, and the IBF. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the former undisputed heavyweight champion of the world, introducing the one, the only, Iron Mike Tyson. Welcome Britain's favorite son, and he is the current and defending WBC heavyweight champion of the world. There is only one Frank Bruno. All right, all right, right here, listen, listen, and listen, listen. Shake hands, good luck. And together, here we go, round one. Up there. Now that's not. Oh, that goes Bruce Seldon. Come on. That was a punch high it on the punch head. It was a punch high in the head, Freddie. You're exactly right. right hand. And it was stunned him.
see if you have a great chin. You don't have a great chin. You can't get one. You can't buy one or learn one. Oh, forget it. Punch. He's wobbly. You can it's always over. punch. And that's it. It's over in the first round.